Hallelujah, 
worship you, Lord. Worthy, worthy. Nothing so good that we've done, God, but you still love us. Yeah, you still love us. You still love me the same. So we bless you. We bless you, God. We call you Abba Father. worthy. Amen. Yes, he is. Amen. God is worthy. In consideration of time, we're going to go right into the service. Amen. But if it was up to me, we wouldn't have no service. But that's not my call. You may be seated in the presence of God. Amen. 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 We worship God this morning. Amen. We glorify his name. He's Abba, our father. Amen. On Father's Day, we give honor to the Father of all fathers, amen. I thank God for the fathers of this house, amen. I bless God for the fathers who are closest to me here, amen. I give honor to God for our brother George, amen. Amen, amen, amen. I give honor to God for our brother Brian, amen. Those are my brothers, but I know that they're amazing fathers, amen. Amen. So I bless God for them. I bless God for every father in the building. Amen. Um, and we're going to jump right into the program. Um, and we're going to call on our sister Brianna. Amen. 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 Give her a round of applause as she comes forward. afternoon covenant keepers happy father's day Woo! um giving honor to the spirit of god that is definitely in our midst greetings to our apostles in their absence our chief apostle happy father's day to you if you're watching Woo! and our amazing pastor watson <laughs> So today is a Father's Day, a very, very important day. Um, the role of a father. Generally speaking, a father's role is to protect, provide, and be a role model for their children. However, in Covenant Keepers, the role of a father is so much deeper. It's true that our fathers are protectors, providers, and role models, but we also know our fathers to be mighty men of valor, praying fathers, fathers who have God as their source, fathers who are the head and not the tail, fathers who walk the righteous path, fathers who work hard and make sacrifices for the sake of their family, and fathers who serve in the house of the Lord. The fathers of this house are well deserving of a standing ovation. Can we just stand and give our fathers a round of applause? Don't forget George and Lewis! <laughs> Today, we honor the fathers of this house and we say that we see you. We see the hard work we see the love and we thank you. Thank you for being a godly example and role model for your children. Proverbs 4.11 states, 
I will guide you in the way of wisdom, and I will lead you in upright paths. When you walk, your steps will not be hampered, and when you run, you will not stumble. Fathers, as you continue to lead your family, know that it is God that is guiding you and giving you the wisdom you need. He will continue to uphold you as the head of the household. Allow God to continue to mold you, instruct you, and shape you to be exactly who he has called you to be as a father and a man of God. Happy Father's Day to all fathers of CKM. And now we are going to distribute items to the amazing fathers. And uh, I definitely forgot, giving honor to the most amazing father, God, hello. <laughs> we love you. Thank you for being the most amazing father to us. <laughs> As those items are being handed out, we are going to move on to a little special that we have. So I would like to call our brother Louis, our sister Jayao, our sister Nazani, and our brother Noah. Don't we just love our children in the house? Woo! Okay, they can answer from right there if they feel comfortable. That's perfectly fine. So we have a set of questions for the amazing fathers. So the first question, what is one thing or one special quality that you love about your dad? So one thing that I love about my father is that he makes his family and friends laugh. One thing I love about my father is like, he can be funny at times. <laughs> what is one thing that makes you just like your dad? One thing that makes me just like my dad is that we watch a lot of the same stuff on TV. What makes me just like my dad is that we're both short. <laughs> I'm loving these answers. The truth. It's amazing. <laughs> Isn't it amazing when you have that one show in common? I know personally me and my dad, we have this show called Impractical Jokers. If you have not watched it, watch it. It's hilarious. Well, I think it's hilarious. My dad thinks it's hilarious. So it's probably hilarious, because we're both hilarious. <laughs> what is one thing that makes you just like your dad? Okay, next question. What makes your dad a superhero? What makes my dad a superhero is whenever there's a bug nearby, he always comes over and kills it for me. What makes my dad a superhero is that 
He is surprisingly fast and strong. I could never beat him in a race when I was younger. I thought I could, but I could not. Amen. If Noah has an answer for us, I see him thinking really hard. <laughs> Spidey, so Brother Brian has the qualities of Spider-Man, amen. <laughs> Our friendly neighborhood watch, okay, and he's a firefighter, so it makes sense. <laughs> and the last and final question, what is one thing your dad has taught you about the Bible? Um, one thing my dad taught me about the Bible is to never fear and to know that God is by my side. One thing my dad taught me about the Bible is he taught me how to pray, and he's still doing that by, like, bringing on the men's prayer line. It's really difficult. Amen! Building up the next generation. Woo! And last. B-I-B-L-E, woo! That's the Bible, woo! Pastor, Bible B goes down to this age. You might want to consider for next year. <laughs> Amen. Thank you for all the amazing answers. Thank you to you, amazing fathers. And next. We have the ministers of Judah. plaguing our generation is people trying to figure out who they are. This is a song to our generation. We bear the name of the Father and in Him we find our identity.
thank God for the dancers of Judah, the ministers of Judah. Amen. 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 If you could please stand, we're going to just uh, sing a song of worship. Amen. Before we go into the word. Amen. Amen. We came to worship the King of Kings. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Holy, that's who you are, angels, and earth sing the song for your honor, cause power belongs to you, power belongs to you. Bye. 